guys, French President Emmanuel Macron. That's right, Emmanuel Macron. I just like to say that name, Macron. He is getting ready to put a ban on gender-based insults. This is not a joke. This is something that he is actually going to do. And if it's violated, if you are caught using a, any sort of an, an insult, especially if it's if it's directed at a woman in light of all the sexual harassment, you will be fined among other strict disciplinary action that could come against you from this. I would love to hear what you guys think about this, especially if there's anybody watching from France. And I've had some people from France uh, right on here and watch some of my videos. So I'd be very curious. But here is what is going on. They want to ban these insults now. Uh, and also, you know, the wolf whistling, you know, uh, when you do that at women and everything like that, um, in the streets, in a crackdown against sexism. It's all. It's what it's all about, like I said, which can be a very good thing. But do you think it's going to lead uh, to possibly other types of censorship and, and cracking down? Just saying but anyway, the country's president said this in a speech. Emmanuel Macron said that it was unacceptable for France to be, quote, one of those countries where women live in fear of verbal violence against women. Gender-based insults will be punishable by law, and offenders will face a deterrent fine, Macron said. Many women have said that the first sexist violence that they, that they actually enact is in the streets. And so that is going to be marking an international day for elimination of violence against women. Macron also goes on to state, and many harassers practice wolf whistling and other types of verbal stigmatisms. And for a long time, people reacted with indifference to this. So he is very serious about this, guys. He said this is unacceptable and women must feel comfortable in public spaces Women in the public, they must not be afraid to use public spaces. This must be one of the priorities of the police. So what do you guys think? Again, I mean, pretty incredible that they're going to crack down on this in France. If you were caught you know, using any sort of these slurs or gender insults against women, you're looking at some heavy fines. And who knows what else they might uh uh, they might come up with with, with a punishment. Could you be talking jail time even? I mean, as far as violations stack up against you, crazy stuff. Um, we do need to make sure that we're taking care of women and, and, and being more aware of what's going on with sexual harassment. Do you guys think this will work? Do you think it will not work? Is it a good move by President Macron? Let me know. Let your voices be heard. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, guys. One thing is for sure, and I always say this, we're living in the last days. Jesus Christ is coming back soon. You can know it. You see the sexual immorality, the, the rape allegations against congressmen, politicians, people in Hollywood. It's getting to be too much. If you don't know Christ as your Lord and Savior, if you would like to, please let me know. Leave me a comment below. Let me know you would like to receive Jesus as your Lord and Savior today. You could be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. Come into the kingdom of God today where you will have everlasting life in a home in heaven for all of eternity. There's no greater decision that you're ever going to make than to give your life to Christ. I pray you guys make that decision today. You can also email me directly at cardsfan480 at gmail.com. I'll put my email right below in the description. You guys can access it from there. Please also send in any prayer requests you may have, guys. I'd love to help pray with you. Whatever it is you're believing God for today, it's good for the body of Christ to come together and lift one another up in prayer. All right, guys, I'll continue here to keep you up to speed on all the latest breaking news, prophecy headlines, and current world events. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. Don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. God bless each and every single one of you, and I'll talk with you soon.